Let's all grow together. What's up YouTube? So today I'm gonna show you guys how to set up a wireless range extender. Okay, so I started on this screen because your WPS needs to be enabled for this. You can do it another way, but you wouldn't really be looking for a video if you knew how to do that the other way. So I figured we start with this. Um, I'm not gonna show you the whole screen because it's gonna give you my passwords to my internet and stuff like that, which I don't want to do. So I'm just gonna go ahead and hit the back button. All right, so if we're at a new tab, the way you're gonna find that thing that I just was at would be um, your standard um, IP address, which you can find on the bottom of your router, is gonna be 192.168.0.1. Um, and it may differ depending on your router, but usually that's the one. And so it already logs me in and just shows you my password, which I don't really care. Uh, anyways, uh, it's because I'm already logged in for a certain amount of time. So your, your normal uh, password will start off um, being admin and then password. All right, so um, you wanna make sure WPS is enabled, which it probably is. Um, <clears throat> and then once it is, you're gonna come over here, you're gonna take your Linksys uh, range extender, right? Which I had, so I was gonna set it up the hard way, but I figured, eh, let's make a video showing these guys how to do it, because I had that security video showing you guys how to set up a security um, system in your home for like $15 a month, unlimited recording and all that good stuff, and being able to, um, let me flip this, $15 a month, and then you know, and, and you're able to get unlimited recording and all that good stuff. So I figured, since I'm gonna show you guys how to get the unlimited recording, I'm gonna show you guys how to effect, efficiently set this up, and you know, to be, if you got a bigger home, you're gonna definitely wanna have more cameras. And being that they're so cheap to put up, I think I spent eighty dollars on my two S5 actives. Here's one of these little pins. This is what I use here to um, reset this Linksys. But um, <clears throat> being that they're so cheap, you know, it's just kind of fun to put them up because it's fifteen dollars for the stand, like you know, forty dollars for each camera, and each camera gives you two um, viewpoints. Plus, you're, you're only paying five dollars for the warden cam which is the monitoring system um through the google play store which you can use your uh, ios for your you know your apple phones or you can use um you know windows or mac as well to view these um and so all right i'm going to show you guys real quick how we're going to use a use linksys because i figured you guys want to get the cheapest way possible like i do uh, so i'm going to stop it and flip the cam so with this you're just going to figure out where you want to plug it in and now my router is there right so I'm gonna go and take this and put it and well, let's see, it's kind of dark, it's nighttime. So the hallway really isn't bad. Just the fact that it's so, there's so many walls in between that. Um, so I don't know that this is gonna work properly, but let's just plug it in. And once we plug it in, let's see, I'm gonna, let me get a light on here so you guys can see. see it a little bit better um, all right so now there's there's a on, on the side of this so look on this on this uh, range extender just kind of real close. Uh, you see on the side there there's this, this reset button you just take a little that little sony needle pin or whatever you can find to fit in that hole and you just kind of get it in there and hold it down until this light turns green you'll see it turn green here about three seconds one two oh there it is boom okay so that's all you do um, so now it's in setup mode. Just stop it. Okay, so to do that, what we need to do is go to this link that is right there. And this is actually not the right link. Sorry about that. Um, extended links is right here. This is the one. You're connected to the range extended network yet. Oh, you're not connected. Okay, so now this is what we're going to do. We are going to hit the WPS button. Here, hit it and hold it. Okay, it's not working because we go back to my one nine two dot one six eight zero dot one. I have my password saved, but your password would be admin and then password. Uh, 
Okay, so we want to hit enabled and then we on the WPS thing and then hit apply. It's going to update that way, it's WPS capable. And once that turns on, now we can hit the button on top. See what's flashing. And we're gonna come over here, back to the range extender, and we're gonna press this button right here. You guys, you guys can't see this with that button on the side. What when I hit it, it should light up. See that button? That's right there on the side with the right antenna. Okay. So now, when the light is green and it's solid, it is ready for setup. If not, that means there's too many walls in the way. Oh, there it is, it's ready for setup. Okay, so we're gonna come back to the computer and we're gonna go back to this link that we were just at, rank wires, range extender, okay. All you need to do now is hit Control R. It's gonna refresh your page, okay. Tells me to choose, we're gonna choose the one I have, which is, is this one, and then we go to. Um, oh, I'm sorry, we go down here to the where our wireless line network is. Okay, so. Damn it, it went away. Simplified Public Extension EXT. Okay, so it's, it's done, it's working, connect. And so my password should be the same. Let me see. The newer version of the network should have links this piece. Let's connect to them. I believe it's just going to be the same password, right? So I'm going to put in the same password um, that I have. Verifying and connecting. Boom, we set it up. There you are. You have your Linksys wireless range extender set up. Completed. Simplified by Dylan. Thanks for watching my videos and check out the security video that I put up there on how to. Is, I'm going to put the link below. It'll be the first link in the um, description. It shows you um, how to set up a wireless security system uh, with old phones, um, Warden Cam, and Google Drive. And with, for $10 a month, you get unlimited storage so you can record all day. You get night vision, two way uh, audio so you can talk to people, you can hear them. It, you know, it, it's got, um, I said night vision already. Uh, there's motion detection on there too, as well. So if you don't want to have to go through a whole bunch of recording to find out, you know, one thing, you can just get it to record motion only. Um, and so that's all, that's all cool. I like that. Um, it's a pretty good system, pretty good feature. I like, you know, uh, this whole setup I have. And it's a lot cheaper than anything out there. I think Netgear Arlo and a couple other places, you can go uh, like $100 you know, per camera to record constantly every day. So it gets pretty pricey. So very good alternative, $15 a month, unlimited recording, unlimited cameras. You can monitor it from any phone or device that's uh, Android, iOS, iOS, or OS X. Um, windows so anyways thank you guys for watching my channel if you guys got any help from this and you want to help me out as well there's the paypal link below thank you and